All right, what's going on guys? Out here getting a little practice in. Uh, just gonna update you with how everything's going with me, Hal and Zeke, and how it's affecting my day-to-day -day life. All right, so today is Wednesday. On Sunday night, I had my fifth injection. Uh, I'm supposed to have started uh, doing two per week, but I'm gonna hold, on that, hold off on that for one more week because I am having some reactions on my leg. Um, you know, nothing, nothing crazy, nothing that they've never seen before, but definitely something that we want to give my body more time to acclimate to. Uh, next week, we're going to start something. We're going to do it four weeks, and I'm going to do it. I'm going to do injections twice a week of 2.5 milligrams. Um, that's not uh, generally uh, what they schedule for a patient, but since I'm having some reactions, just want to slowly ease into it. So for a month, I'm just going to be doing small injections twice a week. All right, so I'd just like to address what kind of reactions I'm getting. So immediately when I take the injection, it's nothing, it's a really small needle, doesn't hurt a bit, uh, don't, no problems with that. And I usually won't get any reaction until the next morning if I do it at night. Now I wake up with a little bump on my leg, it uh, doesn't really get significant until the next day. The next day it's very risen, um, it's swollen, and um, it, it hurts quite a bit. Um, but it's not that bad if you're, if you're not doing anything. You know, if you're walking, uh, it'll hurt a little bit, and especially if you get hit there, that's when it really hurts. Um, as of now, it was Sunday night, now it's Wednesday. It doesn't hurt that bad. Um, everything's fine, and I'm gonna be ready for the next injection come Sunday. All right, so out here doing what I love, um, practicing a little golf. It doesn't affect that really at all. Um, one thing that I have to do is I have to make sure to keep my EpiPen on me, uh, just in case the rare chance that I get a reaction that's, um, I don't want to say life-threatening, but you know, it slowly causes me to, to struggle to breathe. That's when I can use this baby, and uh, it'll stop that and give me plenty of time to get to the hospital. But that is very, very unlikely, and they really didn't see that very much at all in the trials. All right, now it's time for me to get back to practicing and uh, see if I can hit a good shot for you guys here.